Fastest time? Question mark. Like first try. Uh, this is a first try recording. Hope you know. So, so that's Spookwood. Oh my gosh! I'm gonna kill. Hey, what is up, guys? My name is Blades Killer, and today I'm bringing you guys another video. Today's video, pretty much, I am going to be showing you guys a pretty easy, a um, not pretty, really, not pretty easy, a really, really simple way to find cave crawler wood, to find blue wood, whatever you want to call it, electric wood. I don't know what people call it anymore. To find the man who says my boat shop is around here. To find the painting shop. To find any single thing you want to find in the whole entire maze. So you're gonna go across the ferry to get to this maze. You're gonna go inside of the cave, okay? This is the easiest thing ever. Some people already know about this, and if you're like, if you're watching this video, you're probably like, oh, there must be a secret way, huh? It's really not a secret way. It's super easy. All you have to do, and you know, you're gonna get super mad at yourself and pr pretty triggered. All you have to do is zoom out all the way. See? Look at this view. Look, I know you have to like arrange your camera sometimes so you don't hit the wall. But look at this view. All the way back there is Spookwood. I mean, oh gosh, Spookwood. Ooh, that would be kind of cool um, for Halloween. That actually, that would be a really good idea. And Halloween's in a couple days. And I'm going to be uploading this after Halloween, but um, that'd be kind of cool. Um, I hope I hope I find Spookwood for that matter. Um, but there's Bluewood and the Cave Crawler Wood all the way in the back. And the teleport teleporter is, is on the right here. I'm not sure if I can show it. See, see that brown stuff right there? That's the teleport. If you want to go there, just follow the path, follow this. It's really simple to get to. But I'm not going to show you guys how to get there. I'm going to show you guys really... This is pretty much the video right here. I'm not going to end it because I want... The main thing in this cave is the cave crawler wood. So if you want to find cave crawler wood, if you want to find blue wood every single day, use this method. So pretty much I want to go back to the entrance of the cave. And I'm going in first person because it's kind of hard to see your car. Kind of hard to see where you're going back. So I'm going to go backwards to the start of the cave. So now that I'm starting the cave, I'm at your point right now. I'm where you are, and I'm going to back up. So I'm exactly where you are. Come on, come on. Okay. So the cave crawler wood is always going to be on the left. You're always going to go start off with the left. Now we go here. If I messed up, I'm sorry because I'm not an expert at this. But see on the right, you see how this black. But that is. Those are the walls that cover up different entrances to get to the cave crawler wood. So I think, let's see, which one do I have to take? Just gotta look, look at the entrances. Is it this way? And you see, I would go that way, but... Let's see. It's, it's very, it's not very difficult. I'm telling you guys, 100% it is 100% more difficult to do it the other way than this way. Okay, I think it's this way. So you're just gonna follow this. You're gonna just always start off on the left side, I'm telling you. So that's not the right way, so you're gonna have to go further. So... I am going to get myself out of this mess, because I don't wanna spend the whole video doing this. Come on. I don't wanna get stuck, okay. So, it's still quite challenging, but it's so much easier. You don't have to go... So, pretty much this allows you to not watch a YouTube video to find where Spook would, or gosh. I wish to find where cave crawler cave crawler wood is. You don't have to watch a video to find where it is. You can do it yourself every single day of the week, or not every single day of the week. Whenever you want to, for that matter, any single time. I, I mean, actually, that does work every single day of the week. You can. So I want to go. Just keep in mind that the uh, blue wood is always in the back. Okay? I already see the entrance to it. I don't know if you do. See over there? See that's like open. So I'm going to go here since I see that there's a black line right there. Um, it's in the pits in the way of that. See, I'm not even looking at my car. I'm simply, simply put, looking at my surroundings. I'm looking at the walls, and look at that. Fastest time? Question mark. Like first try. Uh, this is a first try recording. I hope you know that. So. So that's Spookwood. Oh my gosh, I'm gonna kill. I'm kidding, I'm not gonna do that. Whoa, where's all the trees? Okay, well, there's not a lot of trees here for some reason, but you see, it is still Bluewood, not Spook. That'd be kind of cool. Sinister, ooh, Sinister, that'd be awesome. So I'm gonna, to go back, simply follow the exact way. I'm using a small car because it's easier to get around in here than a big car because it's bigger. And just follow the way back. You don't have to watch my video. Okay, for that matter, don't watch my video. Just 
to um, show you where you're, where you're going. Do it on your own because you're gonna need to learn how to do this on your own without my help. So, oops, sorry, not this way. You're gonna need to learn how to do it on your own. See, yep, you might take a couple of tries, but it definitely won't take. Because one time I was in this cave, like an hour trying to find uh, blue wood, and it took so long. It was the longest process ever. But now that I found out this little cool trick, I can find it in minutes. I can go. Okay, I'm gonna stop saying for that matter because that's probably annoying me and you. Um, but you can go anywhere, anywhere you want in the cave, super fast. So pretty much what people get, usually get stuck on here is what people usually get stuck on. There's like a half. There's like a half of the maze that people usually get stuck on. It's like one side of the maze that's usually just explored. But the other half, where Bluewood is at, and where a couple other people are, that says like my boat shop is around here somewhere. Like some say people died in here or something. I don't know. There's, there's a couple of guys who talk like that. And to get to there, you have to go to the other side. Pretty much to get there, it's almost always on the left. I, I know the um, things change, the black, um, black walls change every day, but I think always I think you always start on the left. But if you don't, and if and I'm wrong, I'm sorry, but you can use the same exact method to go wherever you want. So if there's a new blue blue wood opening, don't wait for someone to make a video on it. Don't wait for your friend Jason to make a blue wood video. Don't do that. Use my method. Use the method I probably didn't create it. There's probably someone who found it out before me. I didn't look up any videos to find this, but use this me method to find out if you wherever you want to go. If you want to go to that that dirt place and to that teleport to you back to the main island, then do that. If you want to go to get blue, which is the most popular place in this cave, then do that. If you want to go see the person who says my boat shop is around here somewhere, make a video on that, that's cool. And if you want to go to the painting shop, you go the same exact way as it started, you turn left first. And pretty much to get to everywhere, it's pretty much on the left first, besides the right um, one where, the, where, the, where there's the dirt. You can probably make it back to the ferry before it leaves again, which is insanely fast with, okay, probably not with fluid, but you can make it back. It's probably the fastest fastest method of finding blue wood. I remember, yeah, don't spend hours waiting for a video from a YouTuber for the day um, that you want to find it. Don't spend hours trying to find it on your own in the dark. Use this method. I'm telling you guys, it's so... I know, I'm, going, I'm rambling on about this. I'm babbling on about this. But it's the easiest method to go anywhere in the map. In that cave, in out of the cave, zooming out is the key thing. If zooming out wasn't a thing in Lumber, then I don't know. It wouldn't be fun. Because you couldn't look at walls, you couldn't find peak wood in the walls like I made in the earlier video. You cannot go anywhere, you cannot do this trick. You cannot do any of that. But now, but since you can do that, use it. Use it to your advantage to get lots of blue wood right now. I know people said it's being taken out of the game, and it's not being taken out of the game. I'm telling you that 100%. As far as I know, I know there's no evidence that Default was going to take pink wood out of the, or blue wood out of the game. Um, that's pretty much it for the video. Thank you guys for watching the video. If you did enjoy, drop a like. Make sure to subscribe. If you did not know this tactic or this did help you find spook or, or oh my gosh, come on, I'm sorry guys. It's three wait three days before before Halloween and spook is probably going to be common. So I don't know, but use this to your advantage around the map in Lumber Tycoon or in the cave. So if you didn't know about this and it's helped you find some stuff, like the video and subscribe. Make sure you turn post notifications on for my channel so you'll be notified whenever I do upload. Make sure you subscribe and yeah, that's pretty much it for the video. Um, yeah, peace. Ah! Oh no, shoot, I'm gonna die. Oh,